So I had work today, and I decided for one reason or another that I was going to do the exact opposite of what I said I was going to do, which was be more serious. And um, so the reason why I decided to do that, I don't know the exact reason, but I was joking to myself, making videos to myself about being, you know, you know, wild and, you know, just just for my own amusement. I, I was feeling actually kind of um, constrained, so I was just acting out on to myself on the camera, you know, on, yeah, and uh, I started doing this thing instead of acting out a withholding so being like awkward with like just on camera with myself just because I found it funny so I I was doing I was doing this basically I'll, I'll perform it for you it's like My name is John. Uh, I don't know how funny that was, but but I was just doing like saying things like that way. So I decided to go to work and try to do that. And an interesting thing happened. I went to work. It wasn't exactly like that, but it was kind of a variation. And what ended up happening was I was being, I was kind of being awkward on purpose. It's like saying awkward things. Um, and, you know, but but the 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 thing <coughs> that really made a difference <coughs> was I wasn't going on autopilot. I was pausing. I was doing a lot of pausing. So I would just so I would just you know be taught be 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 listening to everybody, and I would pause and I, and I would just say you know blah 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 blah. blah. I, I don't have, you know, the words. <clears throat> it has to be in the moment with people around. But but what I would say would be honest, uh, to the point. It would be something that I wanted to talk about. And it would be something amusing to me and to other people if it didn't weird them out. So, that was really like oh, an awakening moment, because I was just like, because after I was doing that, and I was getting some positive feedback from it, <clears throat> and I was also, uh, well, through the progression of the night, I've had a series of interesting conversations. And so, I came to the conclusion that the reason that I wasn't having interesting conversations before was because... I wasn't putting out what I wanted to. Instead, I was I was doing what I thought would get me would, would would make the day go smoother without really thinking about it and just letting it come out, you know, cheap pop here, you know, make people laugh here, uh, you know, just listen to people talk about what they want to talk about and instead of doing that I was just I was just like like not even really listening to anybody else I'm just like oh it's pretty hot in here why isn't the air conditioner on 
and I went to my friend like, hey, because he's interested in science, so I was like, hey, did you learn anything about science recently? And then he would tell me about, you know, a little something that he learned in science, and I'm like, oh, cool. And then, you know, I'd, you know, go in the elevator, that was my post for today, and I would just, just like, talking to the patrons, and it, it just, since I was paying attention every second, I wasn't saying anything on autopilot, so I was paying attention to everybody every second, I was noticing everything, and I just wasn't saying anything anything off the cuff wasn't trying to be witty wasn't trying to be fast because one problem that I have is I'm always trying to be I'm always trying to get the words out fast it doesn't and, and not putting enough thought into it um, trying to get the words out fast in, in social situations and in social situations, you know, this is different because I'm talking to, you know, you guys through this camera and there's nothing else going on, nobody's talking about anything else. So with other people, I would go with the flow and try to, try to, you know, basically get cheap pops and, uh, you know, meaning just make them laugh and, uh, and listen to people and bullshit bullshit with people. I, I, I became a bullshit artist. Just bull, just constant bullshit with people. And now I realize I can have deep conversations if I want to, as long as I don't go on auto, autopilot. And as long as I amuse myself. What was my quote? I wrote it down. Let's see. This is my, this is my new, my new quote. I, I I wrote it. I I know the gist of it, but I just want to get exactly what I wrote down. Yeah. If you're not amusing to yourself, you won't be to anybody else. So if you're not amusing to yourself, you won't be to anybody else. So the key is to amuse yourself in a conversation. Like with the awkward thing, I found it hilarious. I found it, I found it hilarious. So I was laughing. I, I was laughing a little bit at myself, but but I, I was. I was breaking character. But I was I was laughing at myself because I thought what I was doing was hilarious. And then, you know, other people thought it was kind of funny. Some thought it was weird. Some thought it was funny. And but I thought it was hilarious. And when, when I think that I'm being hilarious, and when I'm saying what I, what I want to hear, and it's just much more amusing. And that just brings me to another quote that I say, you got to make your own fun. And it's true, but I haven't lived by that. And so, um, so yeah, so that's what I did. See ya.